Hello everyone, what's up? It's a beautiful evening here. Uh, I'm going to use a little bit of time to talk about the Chinese economy again. It's a very sensitive one and a very significant one. The current situation is pretty bleak and dire. One of the statistics showed the average salary for each Chinese individual is approximately 2,000 yuan. Personally, I, I believe it. It's the truth. There are a lot of uh, jobless people in the inland and the western part of China. Some of the family members don't work. So averagely, that is pretty reasonable. That is the real situation here. So that is why you can see, you can't see a lot of uh, Chinese tourists internationally, globally. Even Thailand has waived the visa to Chinese nationals. Uh, there are no more Chinese going there. This is the real, real situation. So let's analyze why. Why is that? Why that is happening? Uh, we need to talk about the pandemic, COVID-19. Back in 2019, when the pneumonia, okay, we call it pneumonia at the very start, broke out in Wuhan, everyone thought it would be contained. It would be in the control within several months. But unfortunately, it is spread it like the wildfire to every corner of this world. China has, China took the strict, strictest, the worst lockdown policy. So they locked down Wuhan, the whole city. And some of the cities were locked down too. So which deeply, negatively affected the economy. So which made a lot of people lost their jobs. The factories closed down. People couldn't have any salary. They couldn't have any support. Particularly, it was a big blow for the mid-class people. Those kind of people have their, had their own jobs, even had, had their own companies, but the pandemic just blew them. Give it a big, big blow. Their salary, their asset had a shrunk, shrunk, you know, strikingly. So this situation uh, didn't stop. It spread to every city in China. In 2022, Shanghai was locked down completely for almost three months. Many people just stayed at their homes, stayed inside the compound without, ste without stepping out of the compound for three months. So you can imagine, my God, if you had the house mortgage, you have to pay it, you had to pay it, you had to pay it monthly. You couldn't stop it. So many people, many people has lost their income, everything. Three months, you can imagine. So now it's totally opened. It's opened completely. The economy is not like a like a one stuff, uh, one toy, you put it there and then you take it away, you return it, everything can be in the normal situation promptly, within one second. The economy is like a sick guy, you know. I mean, the pandemic made the economy like a, like a sick guy, particularly in China because of the lockdown, uh, the guy is uh, sicker. 
is much sicker. If you want a sick guy to be healthy, as fit as a fiddle, within several months, that's impossible. So nowadays we want to see the sound economy, see that everything can be returning to、uh, returning back in before or、uh, prior to 2019. That is impossible. So that is the reason why you can't see a lot of people traveling around the world. A lot of people re. Re, uh, refrain from consuming. Refrain from traveling. That is the main reason. So, which means the economy will be rebounded, will be rebounded. I mean, at least another three or five years. So, which means the situation will be like this for the coming years, even. It's going to be getting worse, so everybody, you have to be well prepared, and don't overimagine. Don't think that the economy will be as well as before 2019 here in China. Okay. Anyway, guys,、uh, just try your best. I think your 2024 can be better if you try your best, since you are not isolated, you are not quarantined here. You have your freedom to move physically. You can do your own business. If you find a good investment, if you do put your money into the right basket, maybe the situation will be better. But generally speaking, the national economy cannot be in a good situation very soon. Okay, guys, thank you very much for your time. I hope you like this video. If you are enjoying. This video just give me a like. Even you can subscribe, subscribe to my channel, and I'm going to、uh, be your follower at the meantime simultaneously.、Uh, thank you very much for your time, and I will see you guys later. Bye bye, ciao ciao, adios.